Hello everyone, I'm Sammy DG. Several people have asked me what textures I'm using for the uh, walls, the monsters, etc. So here I'm making a video showing you a bunch of different shots and everything, talking to you about the different textures that you can install to make your Doom a high res experience. The first up, which are the textures I use, are the Z Doom DHTP textures. Those are just high res re re remade versions of the original textures. The second ones we have here are the Caco Demon textures. I don't use these personally, but I know they're very popular and the file size for this one is huge. Insanely high resolution. These ones are a lot more darker and different from the original Doom textures. Next up we have the monsters. So I don't actually have any mod installed to retexture the monsters. If you think they look different, that's because I'm using Project Brutality, but if you already know that, then I will show you later in this video some settings tweaks you can do to get your monsters to look like these. They're a lot more smooth and less jagged than the ones you'll see here. These ones are very pixelated. These are the original monsters. So I'm just going to show you various more comparison shots from the new monsters to the Caco Demon textures to the original monsters. If it doesn't specify in any of these shots that I'm not using the Caco Demon textures, then I'm using the DHTP textures. Hope that all makes sense. Here we go, just a couple more shots before and afters of what you can do to your game. Okay, and that looks about it. Now I'm going to show you the settings tweaks that I have done. And if you can see, here's an example on my rifle right here. Just the Project Brutality UAC Marksman rifle. If you look at it, it's a lot more jagged and pixelated than I'd like it to be personally. So what you want to do here, as I uh, go into the settings first off, hold on one second. So you want to go to Options, Display Options, Open GL Rendering, and Texture Options. The high quality resize mode is the one you want. You want to turn that by default, it's off. They have a lot of different variables and each one has a different amount of feathering and smoothing to make it the way you would like it. Here I'm just demonstrating what each one lo looks like. Most of them look a little bit too feathered for me. It looks a little bit too smooth, so I don't like that. The one I use personally, which I will show in just a second, is I think the perfect balance between j sharpness and feathering. So if you look right here, this is it. It's the Z, or it's the XBRZ, and then I use the max the four times. That's the best one in my opinion. But of course, you feel free to play around with all the different texture options and pick out what you like. Anyways, I hope this wasn't too much of a rambling video. I tried to edit it down and make it just very concise on what you can do. Um, there's a lot of other texture options. There's texture format. There's all sorts of different things. So if you have GZ Doom or I'm pretty sure Xandronum has these same settings, play around with it. Try to find what works for you. There's multi-sampling, anti-aliasing, anoscopic filtering, additional lighting effects, all of which can serve to improve the graphics of your game. Just be aware that all of these come with a performance cost, so be sure that your rig is able to handle these different graphics changes before you start doing them. Just test them out, check the frame rate, see how you're doing, and uh, if you have any more questions, let me know. I'm Sammy DJ, and thanks for watching. I hope this was helpful and cleared up a few questions. Bye-bye.